welcome back to another video so for today we're gonna be stuffing what was left over from my youtube paycheck so i ended up stuffing half of it on my first video and then this is gonna be the second half so we have 5 10 15 20 25 30 32 33 34 35 36 37 38 39 40 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, and 51. And then Sierra, one of my dogs, right now she's like just rolling around <laughs> playing with her toys. So, yeah, if you hear any like weird noises in the background, it's just her having fun in the background. Um, and then also, um, whenever I did stuff the first part to my YouTube check, I did put aside already taxes for that. So, um, I had made in total 145 I think, around there. Um, and then I think like $44 went into taxes and then, um, like $51, I believe, <laughs> it was what we had stuffed. And then this is the other half of that. And then also, I do have a star note here, so I'm just gonna put this one in the back. And then today is the 26th, so I'm going to be adding $6 to this today. So then that just leaves us with two more envelopes, and we're almost done with this one. So excited for that. Um, so for sure, I know I do want to add money to Mighty's envelope. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and start with that one first. So I'm going to be adding $10 to her envelope. So then now she has 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, and 26. And I think that's going to be it for now in this binder. Yeah, that's going to be it for now. We might come back to it depending if we have any money left over. And first, I want to go ahead and start with this one. So this is going to be my roll the dice. So let's see. Then we're going to be... Let me do it again. Hold on. Okay, so we're going to be adding $2. So one and two. And I guess I'll do it one more time. And that's a four, so we'll add four dollars. So one, two, three, and four. Kind of want to do it one more time, but I don't know. Should I do it one more time? How much do we have? Six dollars. Um, I guess let's do it one more time. And that's a three. So one, two, and three. And actually, I'm going to condense the ones just in case we do need them. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And I guess I'll do two singles for this two right here. So 5, 7, 8, 9. And now let's see how much it has. So 5, 10, 15, 17, 18, and 19. That's not bad because I think this is the second time that we add money to this one. And then I know I do want to add money to my vacation. Um, I'm thinking of doing $10. Yeah, let's just go ahead and do 10 So I'm going to go ahead and color another one because every single um, icon represents $10. So now this challenge has 100, 5, 10, 15, and 20. So $120. Okay. 
Oh, and then also before I continue, um, I just want to give a little update on my P.O. box. So, um, I know most of you guys already know, but for those that don't, so a while back, I'm going to say, what, like a month or two ago, um, we had a tornado that hit us here in Texas, and it pretty much, like, destroyed the, the post office that I would go to. Um, and then after the, like, the tornado hit and everything, right away they had started doing, like, construction and all that, like, trying to get back, get it back to service. But for some reason, like, the construction just literally stopped. So what they did instead, they just put, like, a trailer in the, like, in the employee's parking lot, um, where we now have our P.O. boxes in that, um, trailer, inside the trailer. Now, it is kind of weird, but hey, at least now I have access to my P.O. box, and then also I was supposed to get this um uh, this letter back in Valentine's Day but because it was like during the tornado and you know all of that going on um this item was actually lost for a while but hey at least he ended up back in my P.O. box so I'm just so happy about that um but yeah I just wanted to let you guys know like I said that my P.O. box is back in service and then since we are talking about the P.O. box I just want to go ahead and open this because yeah I was supposed to open this of uh, like for Valentine's Day and I just this thing was lost <laughs> so it's just time to open it oh this is so cute it says happy hearts day it says monette happy valentine's day hope your day is filled with lots of love hugs and sweet treats xoxo jesse oh that's so cute jesse thank you it says what do you call candy that sings wait are you supposed to scratch it i think you're supposed to scratch it oh my god hold on i don't have anything to scratch it with Okay, let me read it one more time. It says, what do you call candy that sings candy wrappers? <laughs> oh my god, it's so funny. Um, and then it says, happy Valentine's Day. Oh my god, girl, this is so cute. Oh, and then it says, to Monette. And then from Jesse, it says, hope your Valentine's Day is filled with all the things you love. Aw, thank you once again. So I really love this. This was so cute and so funny. <laughs> so thank you, Jesse, for this. Um, and then like I've mentioned before, anytime that I get a greeting card, I just tend to keep them all because I just love greeting cards. Um, like for example, I have a few right here. Like this one, I don't know if you guys remember this one, but this one was actually homemade by Nessie. Um, and then I have like this Christmas one. Like I just have a bunch like right next to me uh, because like I mentioned, I, I just love greeting cards. Okay, so let me just clean this really quick. All right, so let's see, where else can we, where else can we add money? So I know I do wanna add money to my savings, which I don't even know how much money I have left. Um, Let's see, it's nothing but one, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Um, I think I wanna do the nine. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. I'm just gonna do it with a black marker. All right, so now my savings has 150, 70, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, and 95. Oh my goodness, we're so close to another 100. Hopefully next time we'll hit the 100. Oh, and then also, um, I know I've been getting a lot of comments on my videos. Um, and I did try my best to reply to every single one. But lately, I've just been like so behind on my comments. I just say that I do read every single comment and you guys are the sweetest. So I'm sorry if it takes me like forever to reply to them. But just know that, like, regardless if I reply on time or not, I do read them as soon as I get them. So, yeah, I just want to let you guys know that. And then, I don't have a lot. So, I guess we can add money to this challenge right here. Which is from Amanda Budgets. And 
then I'm gonna add three dollars so that's gonna be a ring pop Okay, so now this challenge has 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, and 26. So $26. And then <laughs> Sierra. Um, and then once this challenge is completed, we should end up with $90. You having fun, Sierra? She's like over there rolling around. <laughs> and then I think we just have like $2 left. So I'm just going to add it to my dollar challenge. No, oh, actually three dollars so yeah three dollars are going into my dollar challenge so then that's one two and three i don't know why i closed it <laughs> if i still needed to add this back this envelope is getting pretty tight in here and then the last dollar is just a star note. So I'm just going to put it with the rest of my star notes. And then like I mentioned before, um, the only reason I collect star notes is just for fun. I know some of them can be worth money, but in my case, I don't really care about that. Um, I'm just collecting them for fun and just see how many I can get. Um, so now in star notes, I have 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. Alright guys, so that's pretty much it for today. If you made it to the end of my video, thank you so much for watching. And also like always, if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button, comment, and share. And if you still haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. I would really appreciate that. And I hope to see you on my next one. Bye guys!